Hi everybody, my name is Roger and I'm here to read Just Narwhal to you today. And this is by Laura Eid and Rosie Greening. Here we go. Narwhal was a whale who thought she had no skills at all. She couldn't cook or knit or sing or even catch a ball. Meanwhile, all her mermaid friends were skillful as can be. If they tried out something new, they did it perfectly. Wow, thought Narwhal every day. There's nothing they can't do, but I'm just Narwhal, and I wish that I had talent too. One morning, Star and Coral cried out to Narwhal in distress. Our art contest has started, but everything's a mess. We need a judge, said Coral, and our time is nearly up. Can you judge our paintings and decide who wins this cup? Narwhal thought, I'll get it wrong, and quickly shook her head. She told him, I'm just Narwhal. I'll find someone else instead. She asked Cackle the Clownfish to decide which art should win. The prize goes to the funniest, said Cackle with a grin. Narwhal thought, that's not enough to win the special prize, but I'm just Narwhal, so I'll check with someone big and wise. She found a big blue whale and asked, which painting is the best? The biggest, shouted Jumbo. Forget about the rest. I'm not sure. I'm not sure size is everything, Narwhal said quietly. But since I'm just Narwhal, I'll make sure Shelly agrees. Shelly scuttled around the art, but judged him selfishly. The shellfish said, the winner is the one that features me. Narwhal looked around and thought, those choices don't seem fair. They can't judge on one thing alone. There's much more to compare. Narwhal swam to join her friends. I've let you down, she cried. You'll need a fair and honest judge who sees how hard you tried. The mermaid said, if that's the case, then you should judge our art. To us, you're not just Narwhal, and we'd love you to take part. Narwhal gave a nervous smile and said, okay, I'll try. And she wrote a list of qualities to judge the paintings by. Narwhal swam around the art and studied each with care. She looked at every brushstroke just to make sure that she was fair. At last, she said, each piece of art is special in its way, but one checked every box for me. Star wins first prize today. Star held the shining cup for everyone to see. Then Coral rushed to Narwhal as she hugged her gratefully. She said, you are the finest judge we could have ever found. You're fair and open-minded, the most just narwhal around. From that day on, narwhal would judge each contest she could find. And though she couldn't dance or sing at last, she didn't mind. She thought, my skills are hidden. They're not obvious to see, but just like the paintings, there's so much more to me. The end. And that was just Narwhal. Thank you for joining us here at George Aquarium.